Hey guys, welcome to this edition of Sunday Coast Bass. I'm out here with Jeff at Pino. Good morning, good morning. Well, good afternoon. My guide was a little late this morning. He wanted to be here at 6.45. I said I'm good with 9. Or 11. Or 11. We're at Pino. Pre-spawn's pretty quickly becoming spawn. See how we do. Hope you enjoy it. Jeff scores a nice fish. Wow, that is a good one. Close to five, maybe? Look at that, guys. I told him to come back in here and look at he catches. Way that, sir. Yeah. That's a good fish, guys. Where's the scale? Over here? Yeah. Here we go, guys. 411. That's a big fish for 411. It's thin, that's why. Looks like it's already spawned out. It's all bloody on the tail. Got it. He's probing inside, I'm probing outside. Yeah, that fish just took off right in front of you. See that? See those bubbles right there, guys? That's a fish that got spooked by the boat. Yeah, 90% of my flips don't even go in, Jeff. Oh, well, there we go. And it's a fish. Come out of there. <laughs> oh, there we go, guys. I got him out. I got him out. Little pounder. There we go, guys. Look at that. Red butt, bloody tail. In there spawning. Look at how red that tail is there, guys. This one's still fat, though. Either in the process or just getting done. I'm flipping. Oh, did you miss one? I think Jeff, is that a bite? I don't know. Keep in <laughs> doubt, swing. Exactly. I'm going to see, guys. I think I might have a color. Anyway, this is bluegill. Nope, don't have any. Oh, look at this. All kinds of PP and J tubes in here. Someone had the green pumpkin chartreuse tail. I have a green pumpkin candy. I have a green pumpkin red. Black and red. Nope, don't have it guys. I was thinking of going to something lighter with the chartreuse. I don't have any. So I guess it's PP and J. That's him. No, that's not me. That's not me. I have no idea what you're talking about. I have no idea what you're talking about. I didn't know what I was getting into. Yeah. He knew he was going to have five cameras on him. It's not hanging out in the sparse stuff. Except for that one. Look at that. Jeff got another one. A little pounder. They do live in here. Yeah, once in a while. They all beat up. Yeah. Get that way after the spawn. Well, look at that <laughs> frog. See him? He's right in here. See him? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh no, that was a muskrat. Oh God, mucky as hell in here. Let's go to that other spot. Got him? 
Got one, guys. Got one back in there. I told them there'd be one back in there. <laughs> yeah, that's back in the junk. That fish is way back in the junk. Camera's been rolling the whole time. <laughs> Since we came in here. Nice. Bloody. Or bloody on me. A little bit. Yeah, his butt's red. Hi, Chris. Hey, what's in here? YouTube sensation. Paparazzi. How's it going for you guys today? Slow. I'm Jeff. Yeah, you're the superstar. <laughs> his first fish was only a 411. Mine have all been 5 and 6. You know, kind of like when we fish. What guy? The guy I was just talking to. Been catching six and sevens all day. No, he said he missed a seven and a nine. <laughs> That's totally different. How do you know if you missed them? That's what I want to know. I want to know how they can say they missed a nine and a seven when they missed them. Oh, fish right there, or is that a muskrat? See him? Oh, no, it's a duck. No, it's muskrat. <laughs> we got one, guys. You lost one. <laughs> Not doing so good so far, guys. But we've only been flipping. Everybody in this lake likes to flip. He caught that 411, I caught one in the first area I wanted to go that I really wanted to try. Other areas are areas everyone hits. It's really mucky right now. There's a lot of slime grass. I'm getting mucked up all the time. I mean, he was getting a punch in, but I was flipping light. I was trying to go in some sparse stuff. But it was just Muxville for me. Right now we're over here by the islands. We're going to do some open water fishing. See if we can get some that way. If not, maybe later towards the evening. Go back to some uh, flipping in some other areas I think might be good. What the hell? What the hell breaks off the braid out here? A freaking boat, guys. Wait. Stop. Whoa. Wait. Ow. Wait. <laughs> the braids broke off and there's like 30 freaking feet of line of it before where it snagged. I don't know why people do that. You know what? <laughs> yeah, little guy on the freaking jerk bait, guys. Out here with Jeff. And Chris is right over there. You know what? Got a little one, guys. Got a little one on the jerk bait. Smack them, dap them. Get one? <laughs> Dunk. <laughs> Had one. I got one fish and I've had no other bites all day. No, I lost that this morning. Come on, fish. I gotta get some sort of bite on something. Oh my god, guys. I got a fish. <laughs> Better slow down right here. <laughs> I told you they were over here. Look at that, a little keeper, five hours later. Over here on the shadow side. Straight drop. Another fish, guys. <laughs> little guy. Yay, look at that. Five hours of nothing and two fish in 10 minutes. Another little keeper, guys. Right where that one bit. And there he goes. <laughs> oh, that was great. <laughs> yeah, you can see him down there in that clear water. Huh? You can see him down there in that clear water. Oh, quick release. Got one? Look at that, guys. 
Way back in there. You still there? Oh yeah. <laughs> he got one way back in there. Now he's gotta get him out. He's off. Well he had one back in the stuff, guys. Way back in the stuff. Gotta be more fish here, guys. Like this one swimming with it. Oh my god, he's all the way over there. <laughs> it's crappie. <laughs> Isn't it? Oh no, it's bad. No, it's crappie. <laughs> Multi-species day! Time I caught a crappie, guys. Look at that, guys. Nice, pretty, big, black crappie. I threw it. I threw it in there and he was all the way over here. Yay. So anyway, the boat just went over there. I'm going to fish because I got a fish. <laughs> right where the boat just went over. <laughs> See guys, boats don't scare fish. Another little keeper. Look at that, right where the boat just went through. Told you. Told you the water was colder over here. 63. Huh? Oh, ho, ho, ho. I think I caught it right at the jump. I turned and looked. around not getting the water ready all right guys that's gonna do it for this edition of Seneca's Bass we worked our butts off out there we come back here to shore, we did. and there was an 11 and a 10-4 caught on shore today. So in here it's 63 degrees, out there it's all about 67. So the summer is still getting in here, getting ready to do the spawn, and out there, as you saw, the ones we were catching were post-spawn. Once closer to here, they caught in the end, I think those were pre-spawn, but out there in the back where we were, they are post-spawn already. They were messed up. Yeah, not all of them, but a lot of them. He did good with the flipping, and he caught how many before I came? Six? Uh, six. Went from pre-spawn to post-spawn in like two days. <laughs> but I'll be out with Jeff again, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll be out. He's been trying to get me to go out four times in a row, and I had to work. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Please join us for our next Center Coast Bass Fishing Show. Give us some likes, and please sub if you haven't. Heck yeah. Here we go.